You know, I knew a family of gypsy psychics who couldn't even predict that they would all die in a barn fire. <laughs> hey, girls. Sorry to interrupt, but Sophie promised to rub antifungal cream on my thick yellow toenails. Mm. Well, well, come over here. I'll do it between fights. <laughs> this is what you're afraid you're missing? Because this is a relationship. Seriously, Max, it's something I really want, and now I'm never gonna have it. Get in there, baby. I have two feet. Interesting. She's a psychic, but she needs a bell to tell her someone's here. Max, please don't make me do this. I don't want to hear any more bad things. Nothing bad's gonna happen. She's gonna tell you you have a bright, love-filled future, or I'm gonna kick her in the crystal balls. <laughs> Hello, girls. I'll tell you your future as soon as I finish eating. It'll only take a minute. Since I quit smoking, I eat like a prisoner. <laughs> Come sit, ruminate on your wishes and dreams. Well, my wish is that you give my friend her money back, and my dream is that I'm a backup dancer for Missy Elliott. Great. A wise ass. Do you want to know your future or not? Um, you already told me my future. That's why we're here. You said I'd never find love. When did I say that? And you, tough guy, don't say, well, you're the psychic. Maybe she is a psychic, because I am a tough guy, and I was gonna say that. You know, it's hard to remember. I see a lot of sad single girls. But looking at you right now, it makes sense. And here, take your phony crystal back. I'm not so sure this is a real crystal. It looks like one of those vegan deodorant things. <laughs> and we want our money. Psst. Oh, okay. What just happened? I put a curse on you. Max, you said nothing bad was gonna happen. Well, I'm not a psychic, and neither is she. Laugh, Buster. Nothing in life will go your way, and you will live under a dark cloud. <laughs> will this dark cloud merge with the current dark cloud above me, or fly alongside of it? Look, we don't want to trouble you, but if you could remove the curse and possibly that noodle on your blouse. Psst. <laughs> Oh, no, did you just... Cursed you two. <laughs> Tell you what, I'll lift both curses for 50, or else your whole life will come crashing down all around you. The only way I'm giving a strange woman 50 bucks is if I'm walking out of here with a genital piercing. <laughs> I do that as well. Don't believe in curses, never have. Not since Jennifer Martin told me I was going to hell for sleeping with her boyfriend. But I didn't. I just ended up going to homecoming with him. Max, we have to go back and pay her. Our lives are hard enough. We don't need things to come crashing down around us. Relax. Nothing's coming crashing down around us.